Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to use leverage on Bybit in 2024. So today, we're diving into the world of leverage trading on Bybit in 2024. Of course, Bybit's leverage trading features allow you to amplify your trading positions and potentially increase your profits. But it also comes with increased risk. So join me as we explore those leverage effectively and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll need to go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course in your case, it could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, basically you'll have to go to this top right corner or sorry left corner URL section and simply type by bits dot com and hit the enter button once you do so you'll find yourself at their home screen or main screen of course if it's your first time you'll find yourself on a page like this formium or the logged in but for you as you can see if it's your first time you'll find yourself here so if you have an account by any chance click on here on login and make sure to log in into your account and if you don't have an account click on sign up to create a new account you can create or log in into your account using Google or Apple if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of entering your information manually. So once you're logged in into your account or you just sign up into your account, you will find yourself here. The first step that you should do, if you did not verify your account yet, make sure to click on your profile at the top right corner and click on complete identity verification now. Why? Because without it, you'll not be able to trade on Bybit. Then, or that means you'll not be able to do deliver trading. So as you can see, you'll not be able even to deposit money or crypto. You'll not be able to trade. You'll not be able to do the P2P trading. You'll not be able to earn or to daily uh, fiat deposits or even daily crypto withdrawals. It will be limited. But if you verified yourself, you will have access to all of that with more amount of those two. And to verify yourself, you'll need two things. Verification requires the following, as you can see. Government ID photo and a liveness check. A selfie and the government ID. So to verify yourself, click on verify now. And here we have to choose the country and regions or regions of a hue. And once you choose it, they'll give you the document type that is supported in your region. For example, if you choose another region, I don't know, let's just choose this or let's just choose this. I don't know. So for some specific like countries, it will change it. So you will have to choose, of course, the document type that you want to verify with and make sure that it's a valid one that it's working in your country and make sure to choose different governments uh, like id document if you previously like verified yourself with the id card so for this account you'll not be able to verify as an example if you created a new account you'll not be able to verify your account with the same id card you'll need as an example a password or driver license or something like that and ensure that document that you uploaded are original uh, photocopies will not be accepted and those following are not supported, which is student visa, working visa, and a travel visa. For the selfie, make sure it has proper lightning and clutter-free background, and you'll have to frame yourself prominently in the shot. If you want to verify those things in your phone, so if you want to take a picture of your document ID and take a selfie with your phone, you'll have to do it with your phone. If you want to, of course, if you have already the documents uploaded in your PC, you can finish here. If you want, you can click on verify with the app, scan the QR code with your phone and follow the steps from there. So once you verify yourself, now you'll be ready to do the leverage trading. So first to the woods, let's just go and head up to the markets. Let's click on the markets. And as you can see, we'll find ourselves with the markets here. So choose the trading pair to do the leverage trading on. So as you can see uh, here, you'll be able to select scripts and you can see trade in pair that you want to trade. As an example, there are lots. You can choose whatever suits you from. So for me, as an example, I'll just choose this like BTC, USDT. Of course, make sure to choose one that has the leverage uh, like trading. How can you know that as an example by this multiply by 10, as you can see. So this one does not have it as an example. If you go here, you will not find leverage trading available in here. So make sure to go back. For me, I'll just go and start with Bitcoin as an example. And yeah, here's it in here. So now you are on your trading pair. What you'll need to do, of course, is simply go and access the leverage trading. Simply on this list panel, you'll find margin X or 10X. 
this is the leverage of course trading so as you can see here they'll give you a trading guide why because it's actually uh comes with a lot of risk even a lot of profits but the risk is actually scary so as you can see they will give you some as an example what's margin trading make sure uh, you know as an example what's you're going through and etc et just go and read that then click on done as you can see for me i can go and choose the leverage that i want so multiply by two three four four five six seven eight nine and ten i can choose whatever i want on the leverage of course i cannot go uh, more than that and lower than that so example choose this leverage in here and click on confirm and now you can start of course determine your position as an example so after choosing your trading pair and leverage level determine the size of your trading position keep in mind that leverage amplifies both potential profits and loses so it's essential to carefully manage your position size based on your risk tolerance and trading strategy so with your position size determined uh, place your buy and sell order on the leverage trading platform and you will have to enter the desired price and quantity of the cryptocurrency you wish to trade with review the order details and confirm your transaction of course once your order is executed make sure to monitor your trade closely as the market moves leverage trading can be highly volatile so it's crucial to set up a stop loss order to limit your potential loss Bybit allows you to set a stop loss orders to help manage risk and as the market moves of course in your favor consider taking profits by closing your position simply of course you will be able to do that so analyze like the results including profits or losses and consider how you can improve your trading strategies for future uh, like leverage trades and that's going to be it so for you congratulations you've now learned how to use the leverage effectively on bybit in 2024 leverage trading can be a powerful tool for enhancing your trading opportunities but it's essential to use it to use it of course responsibly and with careful risk management so if you're new to leverage trading or have any questions about using leverage on Bybit, consider consulting with a financial advisor on reaching out to Bybit uh, customer support. And if you have any question or there's a specific topic that you'd like me to cover in the next tutorial, just drop it down below in the comment section. I'll try to do it as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. And if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe to our channel for more helpful stories like this one. So thank you for watching again, and I'll catch you in the next video. So goodbye.